Welcome to the Magisoft demo of Parallels Desktop 3.0. For this tutorial, we will be using an Apple iMac with Leopard. Let's get started by clicking on the Parallels icon in the dock to launch the program. The Microsoft operating system for this demo is Windows XP Professional. Click on XP. The Select button becomes highlighted in blue. Click on this button, which will open a second window. As you can see, memory is over 2 gigabytes. This window displays just some of the many options. To the right of the screen are displayed icons beginning from the bottom right with Snapshot Manager, followed by Return to Snapshot, then Create a Snapshot, the Coherence button, Full Screen Mode, Start Virtual Machine, Pause Virtual Machine, and Stop Virtual Machine. We click on Start Virtual Machine and the Microsoft operating system launches within its own window. We can adjust the window to our own requirement. Large, medium or small. All the functions of Windows work smoothly with the seamless integration of Leopard. Let's now go back by clicking on Parallels Desktop and select Preferences. A new window opens, showing multiple preferences. From here, select Memory. There is almost 4 GB of RAM available on the iMac. If we drag the slider to the end on the right, half the memory will apply to Windows. Press Ctrl-Alt and you will see the dock superimposed over the Windows desktop background. We'll open Safari and Leopard. In Parallels Desktop 3.0, Windows can be restarted or shut down without affecting Leopard. Now we will close down by clicking on the Quit button and the icon returns to its place in the dock, ready for use again. Thank you for taking the time to look at this brief tutorial for Parallels Desktop 3.0. For more information, go to our website, magisoft.net.